Just smells like vinegar. Red vinegar. Bottoms up, everyone. Whew. Ah, good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video, which I am so freaking excited about because I am a huge fan of the show Shark Tank, uh, which, if you don't know what it is, where you will live in, probably in a country that doesn't have it because it's an everything show. Um, basically, it's like these aspiring entrepreneurs, oh my god, <laughs> I think I butchered that word, entrepren, entrepren, entrepreneur, that. Um, they go in and they pitch their idea of uh, the product that they have or something that they're working on, um, and then they show like stats of like, oh, this has done this amount in sales, and then these investors, these group of investors, they're called the sharks. Um, they invest money into these things for a percentage of their company and they make these cool products and I'm going to be testing some of the products that are on the show um, which I've always been curious about. I like always watch it and there'll be like a few that I'll be like, oh my god, I'm actually gonna go and buy that. Um, but I bought a bunch of supplies uh, and if this video gets over 80,000 likes, I will upload another episode where I try more Shark Tank products. But for now, I think I have like seven things that I'm gonna be trying, so let's get on with it and test out some of these products and see if they're actually any good. So the first one is a clothing brand, which I believe is called Beloved or Beloved, I'm not sure, and they're ecstatic. They have all these crazy graphic, oh, Galaxy. <laughs> Galaxy DIY sweatshirt. Oh my god, that's actually a good idea. No one steal it, because I'll probably end up doing it. Um, this is everything I live. So they have a whole bunch of different, like, graphic-y uh, uh, sweaters and other stuff. They have, like, t-shirts, tank tops, uh, onesies, and stuff. I don't quote me on their products, but, oh, it fits nice. Here, look. It's everything. Uh, this is nice. I thought it because, like, it's so heavy with like the ink and saturation. I totally thought it was gonna be like stiff, but it's comfy. And I can move about and it's soft. This is good damn quality. I live for this. And it's cool, I'm like a galaxy queen. Uh, they also have like a rainbow unicorn thing, which almost got like galaxies in this season. But, anyways. <laughs> Let's move on to another product, shall we? We shall. Oh, I'm feeling a little parched, and I feel like I need a little energy. Uh, so I'm going to be trying the Good Promise Power Squeeze bottle. Now, I remember watching this Shark Tank, and the shark said that this was disgusting, and the poor woman, like, almost left crying. Um, it's like an all, like, Fruit juice with green tea extract, no sugar added, 60 calories, power squeeze. Um, what's in this one? Oh, okay, so the ingredients are water, purple sweet potato juice, pomegranate juice, beet juice, lemon juice, green tea extract, carrot juice. So there's probably a lot of sugar. Oh my god, there's only four sugars? Huh. Interesting, okay. Well, let's see if the sharks were right by saying this is disgusting. Um, let's find out. Um, are the sharks on crack? Because this is literally everything. Mm. It's really good. It's sour, but it's good. It's sweet, sour. Definitely tastes a lot of the pomegranate juice. It makes me smile when I drink it, but I don't know what the sharks are talking about. They made it seem like it was the most disgusting thing on this planet. They're crazy. I feel like they could do a little bit better with this packaging. Marketing. I don't really like the blue and yellow. Like, it's just not cute. Down here is great with the fruit and veggies, but probably should rework that. Uh, just my opinion. Okay, moving on. Up next are dude wipes. That's right, the wipes for dudes. No chicks allowed. This is basically um, to clean your butthole when you take a poopy. Um, it's fragrance free, naturally soothing. Um, it's just to keep you clean down under. I want to see the quality, uh, and I'm not going <laughs> to wipe my butt on camera, so don't expect that. Um, but I just want to see like what it's like. It's like a baby wipe, or, oh wow. They did this on the show, I don't remember who it was, if it was Lori or not, but they were just like, this just falls apart in your hands. Which I think is good for the environment, probably, in like septic systems, but like, 
if you're wiping, it just like kind of falls off apart. It's not very strong. That scares me. And like guys, especially guys, like they're gonna like have like a heavy like push with it and it's gonna like break apart. So that's I think a flaw which they said in Shark Tank. Um, yep, yeah, doesn't have a smell. I mean, it feels soothing, so that's nice. But yeah, I feel like that's the only downside of this. It's just just falls apart, which could be a good thing. All right, anyways, moving on. It actually came with uh, fresh balls, is this cream, which I guess you put, prevents wetness and the uncomfortable feeling of being sweaty and sticky, as well as chafing the groin and other problem areas without a powdery mask. So I think it's like an alternative for baby powder. Um, so let's see what this is. All about. Again, I'm not going to be applying this to my balls, so don't expect that. All right, let's apply this to the hand. Oh, creamy. Let's see. Okay. Mm-hmm. Doesn't really smell like much. It's soft. It's making, oh no, it's not. It's kind of. Oh. When you kind of rub your hands together, it creates like a bit of powdery substance. It's interesting. I feel like it's dried up my hands. So I guess that's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to dry up your ballage area. Let's keep moving on, shall we? We shall. Up next is another clothing product and it's called uh, Beard Head. And they have a whole bunch of selection of beards. They're basically for like the winter, um, or I guess just the costume. Here, let me show you what looks like. Basically it's this hat that's attached to a beard and when you, oh, that's how it goes on. You put it on, oh wow, look at, look at me, hello everyone. I feel like I need a sword or a weapon of some sort. Oh my god, <laughs> look at this, I love this building. Oh right, look, am I ready for battle, everyone? This is cool. This would be really sick if I lived somewhere where if I needed to have a hat on. It like just makes like your hat so much cooler in the winter. And you have a nice beard that keeps you warm and toasty. It feels like good quality. I mean, it just feels like yarn on this, like a, a regular hat. It's too warm, too hot and toasty in there, but these are cool. They have like a, a whole like variety of them, and I chose the, the gray beard to match my wig. Up next is a, uh, uh, what is this? It's like a vinegar type thing, a flavored apple cider vinegar, maybe? I don't know, it's called uh, old timey drinking vinegar. The McClary Rose. Let's try. I don't really know. I remember seeing this on Shark Tank, and I don't know if this was like you're supposed to drink it straight from the bottle or if they said it was like a mixer. I think that was like a question they brought up. Well, we're about to find out now, aren't we? Oh gosh. Okay, here we go. Oh! <laughs> Just smells like vinegar. Red vinegar. Bottoms up, everyone. Oh. <laughs> okay, wow. That kicks you. Damn, like, damn, damn. I feel like I just, like, something just exploded in my mouth. That was crazy. Um, apparently, drinking apple cider vinegar. I don't even know if this is apple cider, it's probably just vinegar. It's healthy for you, so this is healthy. I think it like kind of like shocks your stomach and makes you poop or something. I don't know, don't quote me. I kind of want to taste another. <laughs> it's very dumb. Oh, combining one part drinking vinegar with four parts of sparkling water, okay. So this is just a concentrated version. I guess you're not supposed to drink it, great. Okay, second to last product for today's video is Piper Way. Pipe, yeah, I think that's what you said. It's a natural deodorant, which I've actually been using and it works. Uh, so I don't really need to open it, but I'll show you, I guess, what it looks like on the inside. So this is what it looks like on the inside. It's just like a paste, um, which kind of gets annoying. Like, I wish it was in stick form. Um, but you just like take like a dab and then just rub it on your armpits which kind of is really annoying, but it works. I never have like stinky armpits and it's all natural. Mm -hmm. Basically the reason to have natural deodorant is because 
Deodorants are like really bad for your body, like your body just like sucks in the bad stuff and deodorant that stops you from sweating. So having a natural one is just healthier for your body, if you if you care about that stuff. <gasps> okay, and last but certainly not least is oh, an item I've been waiting for. I saw it on the show and I was like, oh my god, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen, heard of, and I need to try it. So basically, it's trying to help the environment and have less waste. So these people invented edible cups, and I think it's out of gelatin. It's a bit bent. I think they make it out of gelatin or something. But these cups, you can drink out of and then eat, which reminds me of like freaking Willy Wonka or something. Who are they? They're called Lollyware. So it's kind of like a lollipop. So have some water. I'm gonna test it out. Pour one in there. The cup's a little bent. Uh, it's a very small cup. Oh my god, it's like things are like popping out. Okay, let's see. Okay, it's not flavoring my water at all. All right, we're gonna just taste it. Like, we're just gonna eat it like it's a lollipop. Oh! Oh! Okay, so it doesn't just like break off. I feel like it's gonna like shatter the whole glass if I take a bite, so let's just try it. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is tart cherry flavored, by the way. They have a few flavors. Oh, really interesting. The more I think of it, like, this is, it's good for the environment because it's, like, biodegradable. But how many of you are going to, like, pour a small glass of water or juice or something and then spend, like, two hours eating a cup? Alright, well, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if it hits 80,000 likes, I will be posting another trying, testing Shark Tank products. Uh, and that's all for today's video. I will see you all tomorrow. Good damn bye. Uh, guys, I'm about to hit six freaking million. It's insane. That's, I don't even know. I don't, I don't even know. It's like incomprehensible. Is that the word I'm trying to, is that a, is that a word? Did I say it right? Four, five. Oh, look, it's gorgeous. Wow, would you look at that painting? Okay, cool. <gasps> what? What? Wait, hold on. Wait, what just happened? What just freaking happened? Wait, I'm so...